Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John, this is Betty a True Dad. Welcome back to Fallout 4, you only live once. Well, last time, I came up with a terrible, terrible idea, which is, uh, let's go into Gunners Plaza, where all the gunners in the world live. Uh, and today I'm going to execute on that bad idea, which might, appropriately enough, lead to me being executed by the gunners. But, if I can survive, even if I do take a bit of damage... Uh, I'm going to be so, so much stronger because the small gun's bobblehead is inside this building. And I really, really want the damn thing. Okay, let's discuss the plan because there is a plan. This place has multiple entrances. You got yourself a front door right here leading, appropriately enough, into the entrance hall. Up on that balcony, which you've got to go up to the roof to get to, there is a door leading up onto the interior balcony. Arguably, a safer approach and... A good way of getting some equipment I'm going to be needing down the line. But there might still be the odd person up on the roof. I'm not 100% sure that's cleared. Then there's a basement which I won't be going into because uh, for some reason there's nothing down there. I don't know why. But yeah, there's just a massive basement with uh, no good loot. That's just attached to this place. And I have no idea why it's there. So we won't be going in. But as a starting point, yeah. Let's start with the... Uh, the front door, and I'll introduce the area a bit, because uh, honestly, I might cow it out. Alright, I've not cowed it out much, but I might be willing to cow it out of this if it starts looking too uh, dicey. Okay, welcome to the entry hallway, and I'm inside, so uh, for the most part, my shadow gear should uh, be operating. First room around the corner over here should be, uh, yeah, Big, wide open room. I'm expecting a handful of mines, but that doesn't matter. Handful of turrets and also, I think, three gunners. Well, I'm a little bit nervous. I can't even see. There we go. There's one right there. So, okay. Immediately, I'm seeing private. That's doable. Now, if I shoot one of these guys, might be controversial. We do also have a, a terminal. Not for the turrets in there, unfortunately. Instead, I'm pretty sure that's for this robot right here, who... I mean, the problem is, he's help, but he's going to be noisy help, so... I'll give it a go. If this all goes wrong, there's only a handful of them, we can fall back outside. Okay, we're in. Unit's in firefighter mode. I'm going to activate him, and then what I'm going to do, before he actually wakes up and does too much, so I'm going to try and take a shot at... Where is he? Well, that's a turret... I'm not really sure I wanted actually. Where's... Okay. You know what? In which case, I'll just let him go in. I'm just going to let him wander in. And we're going to see what he does. Because he should go hostile to anything that's hostile to... Oh. Yep, there we go. Okay, he's attacking something. So, someone's going to come and attack him. He's going to attack them. Private is... Uh, Someone's going in for hello over there. Right, so just take you down, actually. And now, he's going to keep going in. Reload. And who's he going for now? He's going for somebody. And he's going to force them to basically uh, show themselves. So, hang on. Where are... Where is you? There's someone over there. That's... That's a turret that's not waking up. This Guardian's pretty tough, actually. And I don't know the fact that the, uh, the fire's a bit close to... Bit close to me, bit close to me. Where are you, buddy? I can't... I can't see him. Well, for some reason, the turrets are staying out of this, which is... Okay, there's another one. There's definitely another one. You've not killed that guy yet. Then there's an explosion. Okay, hang on, hang on, just... Will you all just hold still for a second? Also, seriously, why are the turrets not... Okay, I've never seen this before, but the turrets seem uninterested in getting... Seriously, hold the bloody hell still. The turrets seem uninterested in getting involved, which is weird. I guess, like, you know, they're allied, but they shouldn't be because this guy is... Okay, it's fine. He's doing a good job. Well done, Protectron Guardian. I'm very glad you're here. Let's just wait. Wait. I mean, I could start taking out... No, robots are allied to robots. Now I don't want to take out the turret until he's dead. Okay, I think he just took out the entire room. That should be, I think, three of them dead immediately, which I'm going to take as a massive win. 
Okay, the turrets are still up. They should still be hostile to me. And if I killed them, I'm declaring war on robots. So, oh, you're kind of already almost dead. I mean, I may as well leave you just for now. Because, yes, there's... Uh, that's it for this room. But there's more people upstairs then again, you know what? I mean, buddy, you've done a good job. But I'm afraid now it's time to go to sleep. So, yeah, I need the turrets down at this point. So, yeah, that's now declared war on robots. Fall back a little bit here. Fall back. Fall back. They shouldn't really be able to detect me. No, that's a Mark V. It would be nice to get them on side, but seriously, I... Okay, never mind. He's just blind firing because they do that. But in just a sec. Yeah, he doesn't really know where I am at all. Uh, one shot. Should be fine, and just as soon as we have got a proper... Yeah, look at that. The stealth is doing well. You're dead as well. Okay, that room is now clear. The problem I've got here is... There's more enemies up top on the upper level, and I think they should have spawned in by now. Okay, they should be up there already. But I can't get up there because there's no stairs. Not here. So now this room is clear. And thus this room from below is empty. I now want to get up top to the balcony. Because basically my target is straight ahead of me through those doors over there. Well kind of. There's another door beyond that door. But like pretty much straight ahead. But I need a special key to get in there. Not sure if Master Lockpicking could do it. But I'm not a Master Lockpick so that's kind of irrelevant. There's a named character on the balcony who can help me. One in the basement as well. I want the one on the balcony. He's easier. So what I'm going to do now is we're going back outside. Because now I want to loop up to the balcony. Because uh, if I can, I might be able to just not fight half of the building at the rear. I could take what I want and leave without having to do, you know, some of the blasty nastiness. Okay, back outside. Rain has stopped. Just... Keep your eyes open. And yeah, we hop over here. The stairs around uh, this side. Watch out, by the way. We did see a handful of ghouls around here. I'm pretty sure they're dead. Now, just sprint and drop. Okay. The brackets did move uh, slightly, but not much. I don't know whether the roof is clear. Now, I know I took out Missile Launcher Man and Fat Man Man. But that doesn't mean somebody else didn't pick them up. Just try again. That was quite a movement on the brackets. Okay. Gunners are not the most talkative. They don't always bark at each other. So, uh, yeah. How many crits do I have right now? Oh, I've got none. Oh, that's kind of bad. Um. Okay. Be ready on the old drugs. If we need to pop the psycho jet, be ready to do it. I'm going up pretty blind here. Oh! Gunner. I mean, I could take the 72 at the head. That's anyone else? I want to do this in vats. Then again, I feel like the bullet's not going to hit. I feel like the bullet is not going to hit. And I want you to... That's probably a more reliable shot. Yeah. 86. We say 86. Um, Go more over there. That feels... Screw it, go! Good. And, oh my. Got an extra four-leaf clover. That was only 10%. Okay, there's still movement on the brackets. Oh, I see you. Okay, to be honest, you're a sergeant. I'm just going to nail you in the head. Okay, just... Go. I think that might be it. Because I'm not seeing... Movement. Okay. No legendaries yet, either. Just... Check the bodies and, you know, pick up the ammo because I never do that. I'm always short on money. I'm always short on ammo. I always need to buy ammo and trade for it. Never bother bloody picking up any of the, you know, ammunition that's very, very useful for that. 
Okay, I think we're alone. Fusion core right here. Just be careful. There might be something on the far side of the building. So what we've got here is... Uh, yes, elevator takes me to the, uh, the basement, which I don't need uh, at all. And then just be alert. Okay, just be very alert because... This is far enough away, they wouldn't have heard the kerfuffle at the back. We good? I think we're good. And then, is it here? Is it? No, it's another level down yet, actually. Yeah, anyone here, I would have already detected. So, ammo, take the rat away. That's good money. And parch, that's fine. That actually means I get more XP on average, thanks to Idiot of all. And, okay, we've made it here. So, now I'm going to come in directly above where I just was, okay, onto the balcony that I could see the rear of. I'm expecting maybe another two or two or three enemies, but one named one who's going to be, you know, tougher. So watch out for him. Okay, here we go. Now I'm looking for either Ryder or Cruz. That's a turret over there. Sorry about that, it can't come and hunt me can't remember which one it is. Oh, it's Cruz as it turns out. Okay, you're getting critted. Down you go, buddy. And Vats doesn't see. There's one person on the far side. Okay. They saw the corpse. Listen for footsteps. Why are they not moving? They might have taken cover, so they are behind me and to the right. At the moment. They don't have an ID on me. The shooter. Okay. And no bark. No movement. There's you. Oh. Oh, that's way more than I thought. Okay, hang on. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. If you guys want to all crowd together, this is what plasma grenades are for, damn it. And go. Right there. That didn't kill anybody. Wait, what? How did that... That was... How did that not... Okay. Um... Now they're, now they're running. Okay, frag mines are still pretty good. They're still... Go. Seriously. Okay, better. And you guys are... Uh-oh. Um, take you out because you don't seem to know where I am yet. He goes down. Caution. Where's the... Oh, oh, I see you. I see you. And then go for head 93. Down. Still someone's cautious. Okay, this is, this is, this is way more than I thought was up here. Actually, oh, hello. Hi, 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 hi. 95%. Take him. And almost up to... Still caution. Could be a turret. Fading. Don't hear footsteps. Possibly turret. What happened to that plasma grenade? Seriously, what what happened to that? Are we good? I'm just going to take that out. Okay. There's another one nearby. But whoever it is... Oh, hang on. Was that... What was that? Did I see movement? I thought I just heard something moving. Gunners are quiet. Okay. <laughs> oh, blimey. Okay. So this is this is good. Don't assume anything yet. Also, the game's playing the Hey, You Found Something music, which is weird because I haven't. Okay. This is fine. Everything's under control. Just help myself do. There we go. New frag grenade. Lovely. The main thing is uh, we killed the name lad. And he is going to have something very special on him, which is... That's... No, that's a sergeant and... What? Hello over there. Sorry, didn't realise you weren't dead yet. So how about we just take you out as well? Okay. Are we still good? Also, I thought... I'm going to be honest, I thought you were Cruz or Ryder, whichever one I just killed. Who are... Who are you in that case? That's... There we go. Okay, so... That's the key I need. Right there. Love it. Don't need any of the rest of this. That's fine. And... Okay. I think...
think I need this room though. This is step one, if I'm remembering correctly. Just scan the room before we loot the golden. Because right here, guns and bullets. This bit's not so bad, because you can just go in through the upper way. When I say go in through the upper way, what I mean by that is, uh, yes, just, you know, take out the outside, go up to the roof, there's a guy with a fat man up there, defeat him and missile launch man, loop round, clear out the entire roof, come in here, take out a named person, and like, four or five others, then you get guns and bullets. Like, you know, it's not that easy. It's still not great. And there's also... Okay. That was just a tiny, tiny shuffle. I think we should be pretty good right now. I think that's this half of the building completed. So where I want to go is, yeah, through that door, brief corridor, then another door. There's the locked door that leads to Wes. He's the boss and he's the guy also squatting on, yeah, the bobbleheads. Now the problem I've got here is there's two ways to get to him. Either I go upstairs, I clear out a handful of people upstairs. Apparently it's day outside these days. And then I just sort of like, yeah, uh, take out everybody bit by bit. Or I go in down over here and... There is an argument for using a stealth boy. Just get through there, get in. Maybe don't even take out Wes. There's an argument for that, you know. This could be my first instance of stealth boying. I'm scared of Wes. I straight up am, and, or rather, I'm scared of the fact there are so many gunners that side of the area. Like, what you've just seen, double it. There's a lot more, and if it becomes a straight slugging match, I don't like it. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know if that's the better... That's the better option. It might be. But in either case, that's actually too far to drop. So I'm going to have to go the long way to get back down to the bottom. So, uh, okay. I may as well start up top at the bare minimum. So just actually check the side rooms. Don't leave any room untouched here. Okay, just make absolutely sure we've scanned everything. I think there's... That's just debris. That's fine. I'm not going to... That's just a frag mine and it was also debris. Okay, just... Yeah, there's there's a turret. I think there's another one. Oh, I'm tired. Okay, that's just basic tired. That's fine. There's another turret. Yeah, he's out here. Okay, that's fine. Because you, buddy, are about to be on team... Me. Lovely. Okay, turret has been hacked, and I'm now going to override it. So that turret is now friend turret. Now there, that's lovely. So get my program back. That turret is now fine, but it's only a basic turret, so... Okay. Through that door is a large room. I'm going to be coming out at the top of a set of stairs. There are a whole bunch of very, very... Uh-oh. What? 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 Whoa, 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 What? What part of flipping... Did did he just hit me? I don't think he hit me, right? No, I'm still at 235, but bloody hell, okay, um... So apparently that turret was... But I just... Okay. I did the override and everybody saw me do it, right? So, what the flip is... Okay, so, you just have to die, apparently, because... Did I just damage myself with the explosion? Was I too close? Because that's pretty close to the explosion, actually. Okay, um... Okay, now I'm in caution again. Now, how much do I have? Okay, I've only got... I've got one crit. This is... Okay, well, this has been an absolute mess. Why on earth did he start firing? I mean, you shouldn't have done. I literally... I just overrode the turret. Just... Oh. Hi for that, legendary. Okay, I'd rather you lost interest, actually. I want you to lose interest because... Uh, 
yeah. At this point, there's only one way for the gunners to get downstairs to me. And that is along this corridor. So, if I mine up the corridor, then we're golden. So, I do not want you to be interested. In fact, I'm kind of annoyed you've opened the door at all. Okay. We good? There's another one there. Sergeant. I mean, this is a good, long little, you know, killing area. The problem is that door will never close itself now. Uh, so that's good. Uh, bottle cat mines. What I can do is I can lay a nice, long killing line along here. Okay. I just need that door to be closed, ideally. Okay, just move him. Move him. And then you're facing this way. Third person camera. Will help me out here. The sergeant, never mind. Okay, there's several. Never mind again. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Okay, if I sort of pop out here. Yeah, at this point my stealth is really good. So I feel like actually we'd be safe to start laying even pretty much in plain sight. Yeah, you don't see a thing, do ya? No, you do not, buddy. Okay, I'm just going to put one way over there. And uh-oh. That alerted Captain Wes. Okay. Right, I'm silent. The mine when it goes down isn't. I'm directly above Wes right now. Which is... And his turret. Okay, he's also got a turret. Okay, what we're going to do now is we're going to put down another. Which is also making Wes nervous. No, that's making the legendary gunner nervous. I mean, I've got two down. That's the sergeant. I feel like I want one more. Like around about... Where are you looking, buddy? I could just snipe you right now. I'm going to do it. Okay, go! Dead. One more. Fall back over here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to snipe. And we're going to use the mines. Is that the top of a head over there? Is that the top of a head? Just be ready to run. Okay. We need to run the moment this gets too hot. And if this becomes an open firefight, it will become too hot. Danger would be trouble. Caution, I can deal with. Now come along, lads. Just a second ago, you were all here. You couldn't wait to be right here. Down you go, buddy. Okay. Who's going to come investigate? Because to be honest, if I could just bring a bunch of them upstairs to the rear of the building at this point, that'd be good. Because then that means the door downstairs is less guarded. But now, now I've laid a trap for myself. Because now I want to see what that legendary was. Was it really just two up there? I thought I saw a third. And now, arguably, this is a bit of a waste of... And you know what? That one's a bit dangerously close to me anyway. I'm going to pick that one back up. I'm going to make a tiny, tiny bit of noise right now. Okay? I'm just going to fire off that. Okay? That's drawing a bit of attention. All right. Hey, guys. How do you feel about... No, seriously, guys. Guys. Hey. Yeah? yeah? That's right. It's a gunshot. They're being annoyingly not good at, at responding to flipping gunfire right now. Nope. 
They don't want to do it. Okay. In which case, I'm going to move forward. I'm going to check out. Peckish, that's fine. Well, now, okay, now I'm removing my own layer of mines. Oh. That's the radio, I think. Yeah, that's the radio. Okay, that's fine. I just want to see the legendary. Just let me see the legendary. And... Uh, oh, duelists! No, that's, like, so bad. Forget it. No, closed door. Right, okay. Unless I want to try and make something happen right here on these stairs, which I'm pretty sure I do. There's another legendary over there. Um... Okay, more legendaries. I mean... Leave it. That's no. Then again, if I leave them there, then all that's going to happen is they're waiting for me elsewhere. Oh, I don't like this. This was supposed to be more of a... Oh my goodness, they've all tossed themselves into my mind. Ho he ho he ho, what a cunning plan I had. Okay. Um, The third step of the plan I'm supposed to be doing right now is... Uh, go back downstairs. And now I've got that key. What I can do is I can open up Wes's room. Now there is an argument to say... Uh, we just stealth boy in. We grab the thing... We come straight back out again. We never actually, you know, fight Wes or most of his goons. A stealth boy, together with my natural stealth, that's... It's an option. It's a real option, actually. Also, can I drop down onto the... Oh, I'm gonna... Oh, bloody hell. Can I drop down? I think I can drop down. I don't... I should not have done that. Okay, fine. Everything's under control. Let's get back in. I think this is the plan. I think it's stealth boy time. I just get in. We get the bobblehead. We get out again. I don't like the idea of, yeah, an open gunfight against everybody. And, okay, yes, that can be the backup. Okay, plan A is stealth boy. Plan B, psycho jet and staggering combat rifle, sprint out of there, murdering anybody in my way. That's basically how this goes, I think. Okay, let's talk plan. Through this door, there's going to be a corridor. What I'm going to do is, yeah, you can sort of see the, uh, the wall there. I simply go, then I just go left, around, forward. There will be a door in front of me with an on-air sign over it. I open it with the key, I sneak around the outside, I get the bobblehead, I come straight back out again. All under the effect of a stealth boy. Now, luckily, I'm really stealthy. As we saw early this episode, when I walked right in front of a turret, there was apparently bloody hostile for some cocking reason. So, this will work. And if it doesn't, we pause, we go over to Psycho Jet, we go over to uh, Staggering, we make a run for the front door. And anyone that tries to follow me, we just gun them the flip down. But, stay on penetrating for now, because if one person sort of detects me, I might be able to just crit them down in order to uh, reassert silence. So, uh, oh flip me, I don't like this. <laughs> this a good plan? I don't know if this is a good plan, um, but I think I have thinned them out enough I can make it fly. Okay, stealth boy on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So, fast as you like, straight through. There's going to be people. There's going to be a turret on the left. As long as I don't get too close to anybody, we should be all absolutely fine. Open, and then just... You are in a very good position right now. Just grab, and then go Go, 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 go. That's worn off. Go, run. Close door, close door, close door. And just are we in? Heist of the flipping century. Okay. Just about pulled that one off. Okay, that was. 
Okay. Stealth boys. Another tool I have, then often forget I have, but on this occasion, that there was the right thing to do. That was that was right. That was the right way to play that. Okay, good. Let's let's just go because bloody hell, I need a cup of tea now. Oh, you sexy, sexy bastard. For those who don't know, by the way, this is a 25% boost to the damage I do with my crits from any ballistic weapon. Which is obviously, you know, all of the weapons I'm using right now because I have not come across a good legendary energy weapon as yet. Together with yeah, another 5% off the back of the, uh, the magazine I got upstairs. Basically, yes, my crits are 30% stronger than they were. And, uh, oh, that's... That's nice. This was a dumb idea, but we just got away with it. Okay, what have we got outside? It is uh, raining again, but day now. No sign of rads, so... Okay. Next thing's next. We're going back to... That's just birds. It's not a vertebrate. Don't panic. We're going back to... Yes, the marina. Because if I'm lucky, those bastards who hadn't showed up yesterday will now have arrived, though. Be a little bit careful. There might be... That's blood bug. Alright, keep your distance. That shouldn't be a problem. Just... Yeah. Watch out for... Ghouls. While we're passing by. There were definitely ghouls in this area. I'm not sure I've got all of them. Okay, no ghouls. But one dog. Which I shan't say no to. Because, yeah, that's a nice easy uh, one-hit kill. I don't see the rest of a pack. So that there is just a bit of a crit. Now, that is... Uh, I need to go down this direction. That little... Yeah, that building is super mutant territory, isn't it? I think that custom mark is still the marina. I think I marked that last time, didn't I? I think so. Yes. So, okay, just keep your eyes open and... Is that the... No, hang on. I'm not seeing anything down there, actually. Okay, and if there's nothing there... Could be... Never mind. I'm seeing a razor claw. Not the worst thing in the world, really. But this feels like, yeah, not the place I necessarily want to uh, cross the river. I swear I've seen mutants up there. And I don't know where they are now, and I don't like it. Oh, yes, I'd forgotten. I'd already built the damn thing as well. Oh, there you are! Day late and a bloody dollar short, you useless bastards. Right, so, oh, defense zero. I wonder how we could solve this problem. However, could we... Oh my goodness, there's a giant cannon. Oh, never mind. I've still got the custom marker from the Westing Estate. Okay, we can definitely uh, take that off. So, okay. Next thing's next, of course. I need to go back to Virgin. As we've discussed, we're going to do that on foot. For the simple reason that... If I go in via Vertibird, there is a chance that a Rad Scorpion takes notice of me while I'm passing overhead. Then, when I land, the moment I land, it pops up. And that there, that is trouble. That is unacceptable levels of trouble. So, I'm going to repeat the exact route I went in last time. So, simply, yeah, to Robots Pioneer, past the little shacks over here, down the underside of that lake. Though, do remember to put the hazmat suit on before we get to that area, because I know that that area just, just dips into uh, the glowing sea. Then I just, yeah, divert south and then follow the route I already went. I should be able to follow the corpses of the, was it blood bugs or sting wings? Whatever it was I killed last time I was in there, I should be able to retrace my steps. The problem is visibility is so poor, it's not impossible I will not be able to do so. So we'll have to flipping see. Also, just... Watch this flipping bridge, because seriously, last time I was here, this bridge was mean to me. Alright, this bridge had uh, trouble. Today, just a frag mine. That's fine. That's fine, no trouble at all. Just keep your eyes open. A handful of mines. Happy to just uh, take all of them. See no trouble there. One sleeping bag, don't need that. Want to keep my adrenaline, thank you. I'm only tired. For the time being. And actually, sleeping bags, you can't really rest at, like, in terms of sleep and... Oh, bloody hell. We're here again, aren't we? Okay, yes, I'm retracing my steps, despite the fact that the last time I went on this route, it got me sick. So, I'm tired, but I'm not hungry or thirsty. 
game. Be nice, 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 be nice. Get get out of the water. Please don't get sick. Please, for the love of God, just don't get sick. I think it would have happened by now if it was going to happen. Okay. I think we're... I don't really want to... Okay, I don't really want to... Yeah, get too close to a... Okay, I don't really want to climb on top of a thing, to be honest. Touching a vehicle is generally a bad idea. Okay. We're fine. We're not ill. Watch the road. I've seen raiders on this road before. Okay. Stay a bit off it. Just in case. Now, there were ghouls there. They're already dead. Scrap palaces over in this direction. Don't need to worry about that. The mutants there shouldn't... Okay. Vertibird. A terrible thing, to be honest. Okay. Assuming Brotherhood, which, you know, 99% of the time it's going to be. And what can we see? That looks like... Yes, that's fine. Yeah, the Brotherhood really enjoy attacking Scrap Palace. They just flip in and love it. So I imagine that's what you guys are doing today. Because, yeah, that should be Scrap Palace at the end over there, I believe, at the end of this road. So I'm guessing as soon as you get close by to there, you'll probably decide to drop down. They're certainly circling. I'm going to go over to here. I don't like them being this close. I really don't. Because, yes, that whole dragon AI thing, sometimes they enjoy crashing at you. So, yeah, just, just get over there. There we go. That's definitely Super Mutants. Good. That should draw their attention. This should be Robotics Pioneer Park. Which, again, we've already cleared of both ghouls and death claws. So that should be absolutely A-OK. -okay. We should uh, be under control. So, okay, just keep your eyes open. I mean, to be honest, if they're willing to say kill a legendary, I'm willing to maybe hang around for that. There's my little robot friends. One of them got a nice little, you know, thingy flashing light on him. Lovely. But, yeah, just keep your distance. Honestly, not my circus, not my monkeys, not my explosion. So, uh, there we go. Handful of explosions there. Weirdly, not the vertebird. Uh, something exploded and it wasn't a vertebird, which is, you know, just unlikely statistically. And yeah, just keep an eye on him. Uh, but I think we should be golden. All right, the death claws already taken care of. And then I'm just heading... Uh, hopefully, where am I heading? Okay, I think I might need to set myself a new marker here. Yes, here we go. If I go uh, due west, then before I actually get there, maybe more like here, yeah, move that to here, and then put on the hazmat suit somewhere around here. That should do it. Okay, Brotherhood's busy over there. And yes, I remember these rocks. So if I just clamber up the rocks here, there should be a couple of houses in front of me. Though I'm also hearing... Gunfire. Okay. The Brotherhood were here last time, but that doesn't sound like Brotherhood fire. Where's the source? Okay. Super Mutant Butcher. Okay, it's Super Mutants. But what are they fighting in that case? Feral Ghoul. Okay. Ghouls versus Mutants. Okay, don't really want in on that, to be honest. Possibly last time I was passing by here, yeah, the Brotherhood uh, gave me a hand without me really thinking about it. Okay, just how many crits do I have right now? I do have two crits. That puts me in a reasonably good position. Alright, skirt around here. Mutants are still just taking on... Presumably a ghoul or two. Just hop over. There you are. Oh, you're a bit you're a bit closer than I'd like actually. And I'm I'm stuck on something. I'm stuck on rocks. That's fine. Just maybe drop down over here. Keep your distance. Keep your distance. 
Okay, in fact, you know, I'm going to go down onto the road. That should keep me nice and safe. Parch, that's fine. And then just be careful because I'm very close to the edge of the glowing sea. But I don't really want to put my... Uh... Oh, hang on, I'm actually going... Oh, I was going south then. Okay, be careful. Bloody hell, John. I might have been just moments away from... Yeah, uh, rads at that point. That's the super mutant camp over there. But the Brotherhood probably cleared that out already. Right? And I'm not seeing much. I'm seeing you. I see two, actually. But I'm not getting involved, obviously. Okay. This should be A-OK. -okay. This house is uh, nice and empty. I think it's time to go over to Hazmat Suit, because I think I'm all on my own anyway. Oh, blimey, the Pip-Boy is in... Okay, the Pip-Boy's in a mood today. Um, so... Is that the Hazmat Suit? I think that's the Hazmat Suit, right? Okay, yes, that's the Hazmat Suit. Marvellous. Okay, sometimes, yes, things are not what they are. Not what they should be. Okay. And now as we approach the edge of the lake... We should be fine, because yeah, the very southern tip of the lake is technically inside the glowing sea. So all I want to do is just get past this area. Watch out for trouble. Alright, should be any seconds now, unless it was one of these barrels instead. There we go, there it is, okay. Okay, okay, okay. And then the storm's going to set in momentarily. It's just straight over the top, and then halfway up that hill, then we take the left. But yeah, visibility is going to start dropping. But this path, I've been long. I've got crits, I have got, if not full adrenaline, then pretty close. That is, that's just a glowing rad stag. That's fine. I'm not sure I really want to cut the corner, to be honest, just... Watch the brackets. Okay, I've been in here once before. That doesn't make it any less terrifying. Okay, the whole world could have been shuffled since then. You never know what's going to be here. I see you guys over there. That's fine. Okay. Eyes open. Just be ready. Where's the slope? Oh, I hate the visibility here. Okay, I think I need a custom... I need a custom marker again. Hang on. Uh, okay, up to 100 rads. We have broken into uh, triple figures. Uh, absolutely marvellous right there. So, okay. What I want to do is, yes, make it down to abandoned shack. That's a good starting point. But, just... I want to go a bit further west first. So when it's like, you know, really close to due south, that marker, then I'll turn in. Oh. Okay. Uh, speak of the flipping devil, actually. Um, we've got an alpha death claw up there. I mean, that's... I could crit that. I mean, a crit in the belly should finish him. And don't forget, you've got the staggering. Do not panic. Okay, you weren't there last time, buddy. You were not there last time. Okay, just... Keep your eyes on his location. I think that's, that's close enough to south. I'm willing to start easing in. Too far to the west, there's rad scorpions. Okay. Just be careful. Those guys move fast. Alright, death claws. Though they look like they're, you know, going pretty relaxed, they're actually moving pretty fast because they're big. Okay, just... Give them a safe distance. There you go, buddy. That's... That's not a safe distance. 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 If we just get over this hill, I'd be happier. I mean, I could just take him. Maybe I'll feel better if I take him, or maybe not. Okay. I think he is now behind us. Alright. 
just the visibility. I love this area aesthetically. All right, it's a really good area aesthetically. Design wise, it's great. I love it. It's one of my favorite biomes in the entire franchise. But like, you know, it is terrifying. It is absolutely terrifying. And I think this is where I came last time. It was along this valley, wasn't it? I think so. All right, just eyes and ears. Yes, that ruin. That ruin had, was it mole rats last time? Depending on what I see now. I made sight to, yeah, I think I looped around this to the right. All right. I think that was mole rat territory. If it was, it might not be any more. Just make your way to the abandoned shack. From there, directly south, the corpses should still be there from... That's just a shadow and some god rays. God rays can't hurt you if you're not a GPU. So, okay, everything's... Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Right there. That was what I was expecting to see. You golden, by the way, we're up to... Uh, I mean, look at that. 101. Okay, all this time in the glowing sea, I've taken uh, one rad. That is why I believe uh, the hazmat suit is the way to go. Alright, just... This area should be peaceful, but I'm not taking the risk and, you know, running or anything. No, 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 no. Bad call. Very bad call. All we need to do is make it back to Virgil. Nothing else I need from here, so just bypass it. Though I did slightly forget something in, uh, yeah, the crater. So it'll be nice to be going back there at the bare minimum, I suppose. Okay, just be ready. Peckish, that's fine. I'm getting peckish really fast, actually. Um, okay. Did I go up or not last time? I know I'm bearing round to the... Actually, you know what? Hang on. Uh, best thing I could do at this point would be lay a new marker. Ultimately, I want to get to Crater. What I should be seeing is the area I went into... This looks about right. This looks right. And that was this where we took on... A whole bunch of bugs. Yes, because there was one down there. And there were a whole bunch up here. They should still be dead. Alright, survival mode regenerates are really low. And I'm not seeing the one down over there. Which is a good sign there's not going to be any over here either. So, my move after this point was uh, go to the high ground. Alright, and then uh, at some point along the high ground, I took a left. That was the point where I saw rad scorpions uh, to the right. The problem is, if that rad scorpions moved, uh, I might not pick the same moment to bear to the, you know, to the left. Which could be a problem. Okay. Visibility is going. It seems to be a bit darker, actually, but... That's, no, that's, that's not how God rays work. All right, Fallout 4, you're being a bit Fallout 76 today, and we know we've had discussions about this. Okay, here we go. I've managed to, uh, yes, jump my way up to the top, and the God rays seem to be behaving. Okay, building over there, I recognize, that's fine. So now I just move along the top here. Keeping an eye open for, I know, at some point there's going to be, wait, was I supposed to be going, uh-oh. Which way was I supposed to be going? I'm coming down way earlier. This is not where I came down last time. And I don't know which way I did come down because visibility this poor, it's very hard to tell. Okay. I'm now lost. Um, I know I don't want to go over there. 
I want to bear around to the left to avoid what's up there. But it should be okay. I think there was... I mean, I know I'm far away from where I saw the rad scorpions last time. I know that's true. Okay, excellent comedy timing. Well done. Good comedy timing. That might have been the same scorpion I saw last time, just from a different angle. He is too close and I don't like it. Okay, just make sure I'm not walking into anything else. Okay, this is fine. Everything's under control. I think this is how we did it last time, right? We just came here. How are the rats doing? 104. That's acceptable. Okay. Okay, we've lost sight of you. Hiding from you. Visibility is starting to clear a little bit. In a way, this is easier at night, by the way. Because, yeah, at night... You've got uh, the big glow coming out of the crater. So you've got a very big visual representation of uh, where you want to go. Because you just go towards the big shiny glowy thing. We're good. Okay. We're good. That marker's looking real big on the compass. Which is nice. Just double check over my shoulder. I'm seeing no sign of trouble. Okay. I think we've made it to Crater, where there is a very useful magazine I just completely ignored last time. So, okay, good to be back to grab that, I suppose. Here we go. Welcome back, lads. And yes, there's a, there's a magazine in here. I just can't remember where it is. So, okay, hang on. Nice and fast, nice and fast. Uh, do you guys remember where there's a magazine? My brain says it's on the second floor of somewhere, so this building doesn't have a second floor. Uh, this building has a second floor. Not many of them have got a second floor. I think it's one of these two. So, don't mind me. Oh, well, Just passing through. It's all fine. Everything's under control, probably. And uh, desk is... I can't remember where it bloody is. Okay. So, aha! There it is. Uh, astoundingly awesome tales. Uh, plus 5% against ghouls. Now, that is not nothing. That's pretty good, right there. So I'll be taking that. Okay, next up, straight back out again. Now, I went last time. It was up here, wasn't it? I, uh, yeah, got up this direction. So just hop up to here. This tends to be on the, uh, the quiet side. All right, weapons out. I'm getting hungry, thirsty, and tired here. And... Yeah, the storm is clearing. Good. Good, 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 good. So just... Now we just sort of loop in the long way round. Alright, if I just head round here to the right... This I remember, except... Brackish just shuffled. Weakened rad scorpion. Hunt up. Nope. Nope. Oh, that's another one. That's the weakened one. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm going over to staggering right now. Don't like it. Don't like it. The moment they burrow, they'll just jump up beneath you and they'll stab you. And I'm not wearing armor right now. Genuinely, I am terrified of rad scorpions. I hate them. I absolutely hate them. They are the most evil things in this game because you can't even juggle them with staggering. They're one enemy that staggering can't deal with because, sure, they're melee... But they're melee that can just, you know, uh, burrow underground. And have I just gone too far to the left? Uh, hang on. I think I have, but I think I've recovered. I think if I just go up here, then we should loop round to the cave. Bit of an awkward way round, but if I avoid the low ground, that's probably for the better. Are we golden? I think we're golden. Not sure what that rad scorpion fought, but honestly, it's not me, so I'm going to call that a massive win. Okay. 90 and dropping. The, yeah, death claw should definitely not have regenerated. Nothing else should be in that area. I'm going to go around the back. Just for... 
nothing. It's fine. Okay, just round over to here. And if I'm looping around the back, that's good news. That there is that's marvelous news, in fact. So just need to get in here. And then I'm going to promise Virgil I'm going to get him a cure for being a super mutant. And then I'll bring it back to him later. And then I am never going to do that. Because I'm sorry, Virgil, but no. No, 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 no. Not happening. Sorry. This area is, um, it's too stressful. Okay. I appreciate you're a super mutant and that's bad. But, like, this area is not good for my heart. So I'm not coming back either. And I think... I think we're fine. Yeah. Just in. Nice and easy. And we should be right there. Yeah, we're right on top of where the Death Claw would be. So as long as we stay on the high ground, we should be miles from those rad scorpions. And then we'll probably do the... No, just the storm. We'll probably do the same route out we did already which is just uh yeah just straight out via vertebird to beautiful beautiful brotherhood territory let's go and there we go got the plans now i just need to find somebody who's gonna help me build the damn thing which is uh, okay maybe a little bit on the uh the tricky side potentially so okay just don't mind me just uh let me go out, because seriously, today I am not trusting robots. Okay, turrets that were supposed to be friends are not being friends, so... You guys better be chill with me, okay? Because I am not amused if you decide to be angry. Alright? Good, well done. Okay, straight back outside, and same as we had a minute ago. One vertebrate grenade, right over there. Let's get a vertebrae and play. Let's get the flip out of dodge. And uh, the route we did last time, we're going to do it again. It worked pretty well. So uh, let's just stick with what we know. Okay, he's coming in. No sign of trouble. Doesn't seem to have caught anything's attention. He's kind of flying over the cliffs right now, which is a good sign. Unlikely anything's going to be there. And coming down. Maybe he's a bit further to the south than he was last time. But so far, things are looking... Yeah, I'm not seeing any sign of trouble. I think we're good. Let's let's get the flip out of dodge. That's him. That's not a problem. So here we go. Nice and fast. Let's go, buddy. And yeah, same as we discussed last time. Cambridge Police Station is uh, pretty darn solid, so we're going to do that. Okay, just let's get off the uh, off the ground. I'm not shooting, mate, but if you could avoid any rad scorpions, I'd appreciate it. But yeah, nothing down here should have projectiles, so just keep your eyes open for what might be a problem. Bear in mind, of course, at any point if I want to, I can do an emergency landing. Generally, it's not a good sign. And if we can avoid... Yeah, music. That's good as well. Straight over crater. Kind of going in our rads by the loops of it. Yeah, sometimes. Just sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. Uh, you actually find yourself flying uh, high enough. You don't actually get touched by the rads, which is good. It's kind of coincidence. I think it's um, if rocks just push your altitude up a bit. Because the game can just go straight through anything it wants to. Uh, the hitboxes are weird in this thing. But, often, it will try to go, you know, up and above things in the way. So, if you get your angle just... Well, something's seen me. Okay. We got angry music, but I can't crouch. So, I don't know, yeah, whether I'm in danger or caution. The music would suggest danger. The problem is, of course, what is it? Because... If it's a thing that can borrow, that's bad. I'm overtired. Okay, we've timed this about right. If I'm overtired, it's time to go get some sleep back home. And that's the chord for, okay, the danger is over. Which is generally good news. That is... That's the super mutant base. 
Okay, the little one we saw earlier. Yes, yes, it must be. They don't seem interested. Good, 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 good. And after that, we should be golden. All right, that car loves just falling off, by the way. Happens all the flipping time. Gotta love uh, Bethesda physics. The gunners are more in that direction. Pretty soon, we should be hitting, yeah, territory I have cleared uh, long ago. I think we're okay. Okay, moment of truth. We're just looping around the outskirts over to here. Not really the target location. I said the police station, but just be ready, be ready, be ready, be ready. Detected. Hidden. Okay, smooth. Nice and smooth. Thank you for the ride. Okay, off he goes. And that means, yes, now I should just be able to uh, nip straight home. Not going to be much going on over here. Because the Brotherhood uh, seem uh, nice and calm. Should uh, be a nice, easy, straight stroll home at this point. Also, John, don't forget to put your armour back on. I was just wondering why my AP refresh felt a bit on the uh, the slow side. Yes, because I forgot to put on the two bits of powered gear I wear. And after a very, uh, very long trip, we're home. Okay, good, 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 good. Because the AP was getting a little bit out of hand there. So, a bit of food, a bit of water... I'll be feeling much better. Although, actually, I need to go hunting. I've actually got two bits of uh, roasted meat left. I've got, yeah, two bits of Mylurk, and uh, that's your lot. Okay, I've been a bit bad about not picking up the old, uh, the old meat. I definitely need to, yes, go hunting at some point, because uh, not in good shape food-wise. And that means now, of course, I've actually got the plans, uh, so all we need to do is build the darn thing, which you can't just do... Uh, I need to get help, which is, uh, irritatingly, even though Sturgis uh, is going to be the guy that builds it, and I'm the general of the Minutemen, uh, I need to, like, get permission uh, from Preston. So, irritatingly, uh, I need to go to the castle uh, if I want to speak to him. So that is uh, mildly annoying, but what can you do, eh? But, uh, yes indeed. Next time, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a thingy to build in order to get into the Institute. And once that's done, uh, we've got a teleporter. And once we've got a teleporter, and thus I can go to the edge of the map much more reliably, well, 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 it's DLC time. Okay, now about level 40-ish is an excellent time to start thinking about some DLC. Don't want to leave it too late, alright? Leave the DLC too late and the enemies start scaling out of control. So, yes, we need to start talking about DLC. But before that, next week's going to be something... Uh, a little bit different, which is, uh, I have noticed more than a few people pointing out something in particular. Hangman's Alley is a bit of a mess and so's the castle. So, uh, next week will not be entirely a building episode, don't worry. It's not just me playing The Sims or anything. But, we will be doing some hardcore building next week. Making, you know, Hangman's Alley look nice, making the castle nice and defensible. Getting everything set up in terms of looks. And practicality, everything's going to be much, much nicer when we're done. And don't you worry, there's a couple of bits and pieces I do need to pick up still as well. Just dot around the Commonwealth close by to these locations. So it's not just going to be a building episode that's completely 100% safe. There are going to be some other bits and pieces I need to do as well. So knowing my luck, yes, in the nice, safe, happy, buildy episode... I'll probably take a massive shot to the head from something I wasn't even expecting. So, uh, the new and improved uh, Hangman's Alley uh, coming up next week, ladies and gentlemen. But in the meantime, I've been John, this has been many a true nerd. And this has been Fallout 4, you only live once. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Ah, we have got a gate key here, and then we have got ourselves... I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake! This is going to take all of my skill and cunning as a hunter to sort out- DIE YOU MOVING BASTARDS! DIE! DIE! Go, go away. Go away, nobody likes you. That was a good idea till it wasn't.